different types of chihuahua. There's the apple head and then there's the deer head. The main difference is how their head is shaped. I'll throw a picture of the apple head right here and I'll throw a picture of the deer head right here. In this video, I will be going over everything you need to know for all the people that want to own a Chihuahua. The Chihuahua is the smallest dog breed there is. He isn't the smallest Chihuahua. The smallest Chihuahua are known as teacups. I'm gonna let him off the leash. I know you guys always want to see the rat and I think I've only featured him by himself on one other video. These dogs can age anywhere from 10 to 18 years. So like I said, the rat is seven years old. I still see a pretty good amount of lifetime in them. The rat! These dogs can weigh anywhere from three to six pounds. I'm pretty sure the rat doesn't even weigh three pounds. Even though these dogs are the smallest dog breed, they probably have the biggest personality. If you think crypto has no self-respect, the rat has absolutely no meaning in life. These dogs are known for their overdramatic personality. Every time I let them out the front door, the first thing he does is bark. That might be their personality or it might be the fact that they're friggin' tiny and they see everything 10 times larger than them. Since they have such big eyes, their eyes actually act as fish-eyed lens. Look at him. Look at him. The rat! There he is. The rat! There he is. There's the rat. There's the rat. <laughs> These dogs can be very agile and extremely obedient. The reason why the rat is my most unobedient dog, I never trained him to do anything. I never taught him how to sit. The only thing he's good at is paying attention to where I am and coming to me. That's pretty much it. If you do want to obedience train them, it's best to start them off when they're young. You want to do it before they're six months old. As soon as you get your puppy, start training them. You can't teach an old dog new tricks is somewhat true. Dogs get accustomed to routine. The rat is a perfect example of that. Because of their great personality, these dogs make really good watchdogs. If something alerts them, you can almost guarantee that they will be barking at the top of their freaking lungs, which is probably the size of a penny. With their tiny little size comes a couple problems. These dogs freaking stink, especially their breath. Another thing that comes with the size, they do very poorly in both hot weather and in cold weather. The medium sized Chihuahua that aren't this small, you are able to keep them outside. It just depends on the size of the dog. With the tiny amount of fur they have, that makes them really easy to groom. They pretty much don't shed. You need to buy stuff for their breath. Like I said, their breath freaking stinks. I do believe the rat's missing his front two teeth. Their teeth are extremely fragile, so make sure you take care of them. They're not the most dog friendly dog. They won't attack a dog. They're not aggressive. They think they could take everything on. Look at him. He's in the VTEC. Holy shit. These dogs are pretty good with people. I wouldn't recommend you taking your little chihuahua where there's a lot of kids. Small kids seem to love these type of dogs just because they're so tiny. Since they don't know how to handle them, they could end up hurting your dog. So yes, they're good with people, but kids might not be good with them. I will be taking the rat to the dog park in a bit. <laughs> he said, what a curious little dog. These type of dogs are probably the best beginner dogs. They have been featured in a couple movies like Beverly Hills Chihuahua. I just know that the rat can smash the female. Who wouldn't want to smash the rat? Somebody asked me, will you be breeding the rat? There's actually an over infestation of rats in New York. I will not be breeding the rat. If the rat was ever to breed, he would completely destroy it and probably create another universe as we know it. I know you guys love seeing the rat. I don't feature him a lot just because he's really boring. At the house, he doesn't do anything but sleep. And when I bring him out, he just loves to bark at everything. Don't you dare start barking, dog. Oh. He's so awkward with other dogs. <laughs> he does not give a fuck about life. <laughs> what are you trying to do? Jump. That's right though, rat. You claim your damn spot. <laughs> that was a girl, bro. What are you gonna do to her? Settle down, the rat. YG, 
YG! YG! Oh. Look at this one. just loves to be with his daddy what can i say hello what's up man crypto. he's at the house huh? yeah the, the small today yeah i saw your vehicle oh which one shouts out <laughs> calm down the rod oh like a little furry rat. Mm. Mm. Oh, look, she has her tail docked. Mm, you like that, don't you? Mm. Oh, she's so chubby. You're so chubby. Mm. 